Welcome to the Ladies Lounge, the podcast of bringing you life hacks, weekly laughs, and funny stories. Each week we dive into silly situations and daily life. And don't forget the cringe worthy <laughs> moments. Do you know what? No. Let's just do anything. Yeah, okay? let's go. Welcome to the Ladies Lounge, and in today's episode, we are talking movie premiere on the weekend we went to. Correct. And let's get talking about our preparation for Bali. Yes, we've got Bali trip coming up and all the things we're doing to get ready. So sit back, relax, enjoy, and let's have a listen to this week's episode, which is great. Um, welcome, welcome to the Ladies' Lounge. <laughs> okay. Hello. Are you ready for this, Tracy? You've made me nervous. Oh, and why? I don't know why. You know why. And I know why. What's exciting? <laughs> What's happening? What, well, let's let's just talk about it's the first time mm-hmm. that we're gonna we're going live on Instagram at mm-hmm. the same time. Which, you know, a lot of people go live when they do a podcast, but it's our first time. It is. So and it's kind of like, oh, gosh, what do we say? But it's so dumb to think like that. It is. We know what we're doing. Okay. <laughs> we know what we're doing. Let's just go into it. Let's okay, go. Let's start. <laughs> so, okay. Let's start. Oh, look at this. Let's start with the weekend. <laughs> All right. Right. We had a beautiful movie premiere to go to mm-hmm. um, on the weekend. So we went and saw Garfield. I was so excited to go and see this movie. Can we you? just picture how you were dressed? Because oh. I, I'm going to say you think it was probably basic, <laughs> but you, you stood out. Do you think I dressed up you, for this? Um, whatever you wear in general, only you can get away with it. Really? Yeah. You've just got that. Oh yeah. God. I mean, if I was to wear a jumper and a skirt, I think I'd look. Mm. Really? It was but like a you, sweater. Okay. <laughs> But you just pull pull anything off. Oh, thank so, you. But it was just a Garfield top at the mm, end of the day. Mm, like mm. it was really cute little yellowy, orangey mm. Garfield top. Yep. Denim skirt. Yep. And some sneakers. Okay, they had bling. I was going to say, they weren't just sneakers. Come on, Bernadette. They're just not some, just sneakers just when it's little blingy you. sneakers yeah. that I pulled out of the wardrobe. Yeah. You know? yeah. And you, you dressed up as well? Well, I just had jeans and a top. So... <laughs> Black yeah. jeans. Black. Did I? A black, sorry, no, black top, top. Black shoes. Mm. Blue jeans. But I did notice on the photo that we took, we got these lanyards. <laughs> I didn't fix my hair, so you see the lanyard. I saw come. that. Oh, I was hoping you only would have. Yeah, only because I know you're a perfectionist and <sighs> yeah. you would have noticed that. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. so I have. And the, Yeah. Now oh. I can't get my eyes off it when I look at that and go, damn it, why didn't I just do that? You are such a perfectionist why? and you're not even a Virgo. No, what is it? I why do I worry know. about that? It's Must such have had crap. some childhood trauma. <laughs> <laughs> so um, okay. you wanted to see the movie because you thought um, you might see it as well before you might take, take kids. your kids. Mm-hmm. And do you think your kids would like it? I don't think they're going to get as much of the humour I felt like we were laughing. We were, but I don't think the kids would have like. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so either. <laughs> Look, I'm glad I went with you first and taking oh, the kids because I would have laughed the whole way and the mm. kids would be looking at me going, Mum, it's Garfield. Yeah. Why are you laughing so much? Mm. But there were so many little things that we <laughs> <laughs> triggered us off. And what triggered me as well is when they played the Top Gun music. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> During one of the action scenes, that was um, hilarious. It was good. I loved it, it was good. So it was no, really funny. I really, really enjoyed it. Really funny. But and you know, like before these movie mm-hmm. premieres, there's so much going on. Mm-hmm. Like you know, there's decorations, and that this one because it was a kids one. There was face painting. There was games. There was like lollies for the kids. There was the lolly bags. Everything. So you try. You're sort of like trying to take it all in. You're trying to take yep. photos. It's a lot going on. Yeah. So you're having these sort of like one minute conversations with everyone, and um, try to take it all in. Yeah, and then they never end. Like you stop this conversation. Oh, oh hi! Oh, yep. oh, hi! Yep. And that's what I feel. I feel so hectic, but yeah. I, I really enjoy them. Don't yep. get me wrong. So you have all these crazy conversations. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and it was good to and see people dressing up, even if it was just your regular t-shirt, but loving yes. the pajamas. Oh, I love the pajamas. Yep. Yep. Yes, our good friends had yes. their lovely um, pajamas on. Mm-hmm. I think that should be a trend that oh. we should. Oh, we've got some people joining. Oh, the wow. Live. Look, we've here got, we are. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> We're waving. We're waving because I can't, I can't reach the phone to go and tap the wave. So we're waving to the people online. Um, 
Yeah, we love, and I think we should start that um, tradition mm-hmm. and maybe start wearing pajamas to some of the movies that we go to. <laughs> Ooh. But it it would it's have to be the right kind of movie. Absolutely. Okay, kids' movies, yes. Yes. Probably not a glamour no. movie, no. like a red carpet movie. But if there's a few of us doing it, then you would feel okay. Yeah. Versus. Yeah, that's right. It's, it's... when you get your crew doing it. Mm-hmm. Okay, also seating in the movie. Mm. Right. We did wrong this we time. We did wrong. It's We're like, not doing that seat no, anymore. Why don't you just stick to what you know best? And we and we got oh, there God, early in this, line. I know. And we said, let's let's try first row back from the steps. Yeah, no. you know, you've got your front section, yeah. and if you're too close, yeah, okay, I get it. You know, it's too close. But then you've got your second platform back, mm-hmm. first row. So mm-hmm. we did that because mm-hmm. some of our friends like to sit there. And we thought, oh, we'll all sit together. That will be great. Um, However, we realised the chairs don't go back in that VMAX 11 cinema in in Inner Loo. So halfway through, we're like, hang on a minute, I'm really tired. (laughs) (laughs) And we couldn't go back. Did you get someone knocking the back of your chair? No, I did Mm. not. Did you? That's the problem when you go to a kid's movie. (laughs) You're going to get the kids. And this happened as well. We went to see another movie. Oh, my God, what was it? Teenage Mutant Ninja No, it was Transformers. Transformers. Mm -hmm. People will leave, like when there's kids in the cinema, they leave constantly. Yes. There was walking around. It was just walking, walking, walking. Yeah. And then I get distracted and go, what are they doing? (laughs) What are they doing? Why can't they just sit? And then the sound of the. Sit down. Sit down. But the sound of the unwrapping of the papers, unwrapping. Although now can we just talk about. Was that that half hour laughing? How disappointed was I? Oh, oh, honey. You were craving sugar that day. I needed something more than just the popcorn. Yeah. And lollies that all the kids were getting is my number one go to. So we got, I said to I said to you, I need I need lollies. So I just went out and asked if there were any spares. Mm-hmm. I didn't just ask if there were any spares. I'm lying. No, no. and I did video this <laughs> and put it on my TikTok because it was just we, we were marked up and even though yeah. I was walking quite far away from you, you were marked up. So mm. I had it on my video mm. on TikTok. I had a plan. Yeah. And it, normally that plan would work for you. Mm. But these I've kids. never been rejected, to be honest. <laughs> and <laughs> I'm sure your husband would agree. <laughs> there was a whole heap of kids in the cinema mm-hmm. ready to go mm-hmm. and there was a whole heap of lollies still remaining yeah so I said to Bernadette I'm just going to step out and say my son's dropped his lolly bag and where, could we have another son? one yeah <laughs> where no. is your son? I was hoping they weren't going to say bring your son here and I would have just grabbed someone I said to Tracy <laughs> come on they saw us walk in <laughs> do you reckon do you that's feel why bad? no I like, don't because no. what were they doing with all the leftover lollies yeah she said no to me because there were still kids to come I went at 1.30. No, she told me to come back at 1.30, which is when the movie started. The movie was full and there was still at least, I'm going to say, 50 lolly bags. And she said no. Oh, no. And did you go back after the movie? I and get... didn't because no. I'd packed up. So, oh yeah, what God. were they doing with them? You know what? This is what happens at the movie premieres is like everything's set out, mm-hmm. ready to go, and then um, they do pretty much halfway in during the movie they they pack it all up because we've gone out before and gone we'll take our content like everything when it's finished and everything's gone, gone. gone. it's all packed so up she probably thought ha ha yep. got that got girl <laughs> <laughs> and so can we talk about prices of things at oh, the okay movies? so okay. i was dry and i was so <laughs> thirsty <laughs> So thirsty yeah. and I thought I'm just going to go and pop and buy water, mm-hmm. no problem. Mm-hmm. Now, usually I don't. Usually it's a, a glass of champagne that I'm buying. Mm-hmm. But um, it was Saturday about this time, which is midday to 1 o'clock, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. And um, so I went to get a water. It's on a Saturday and he goes, <laughs> he goes that'll be $7.20. And I sorry. went, oh, no, no, I've just, <laughs> just got the one, the one water. <laughs> And he goes, yeah, no, that's $7.20. And I went, oh, my God. Tracy goes, no, don't do it. Don't I don't do know. it. I, I'm still in shock. But can I ask you, did you check your 
really? Did you check that it went through a 720? Or did they then charge oh you a God. surcharge for using I, your card? I assumed that was the surcharge <laughs> and that's why it was 720. No, I reckon. So you're telling me maybe I paid $9. <laughs> Did you drink it all in the one? I didn't even see you as we walked out. I drank it all. all. I threw the bottle away yesterday and I was like, just check if there's any more <gasps> drops in there. Did you not take it to get recycled and get 10 cents back? No. Oh, not did. that that makes any difference for one bottle. I didn't. But we hang out and do that as a I family. I put it in the recycle bin. I actually, oh. you know what, my daughter does that with her friends. Yeah. So I probably you should. should. Just get a bag and just yeah, fill normally it. Normally we do have a bag. She does it. Okay. Yes. Well, someone, All right. Good okay. tips there. Good <laughs> tips. <laughs> but we have crazy discussions mm-hmm. during the movie. Yes. And I, I had a crazy <laughs> little chat with my friend mm. before the movie started. And we were talking about this is so random. But we, <laughs> this is so random. But yep. we have to, I have to yep. say it. Mm. We're talking about Botox, mm. right? Mm. And he was saying how he loves to get Botox and you asked him. How often? And you said, no, it doesn't it hurt. It doesn't. Yeah. Does it hurt? Like how is it, you know, how do you cope? Like do you get in the chair and go, oh, mm. my God, like I couldn't do it no. personally. Yeah. But um, and he was like, oh, no, love, I just sit back and I just love it, like just put as much in me as mm. you can. Mm. And then we were like, but don't you hate it when mm. you can't, like show your expression. Like I want someone to know if I'm mad, if yes. I'm happy, if I'm sad. Yes. I want someone to know, to read it on my face. And he was like, oh, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, you find if you get Botox and you can't, it just ends up coming out in physical. Like so then we came to the conclusion, so does Botox cause violence? Yep. Because it suppresses, suppresses Presses. your expression. Yep. And we can't, as a parent, crazy conversation. You need those motions. You, as a parent, you just want to just shoot that like one little <laughs> eye, raised eyebrow look, yes, and just go, or, hey, put it down. Enough, enough. Yeah. That's, That's right. that love language that you don't need to speak. That's the language exactly. where the kids know that look is. Oh, I'll put that. Back. I'm in trouble. Mm. Instead, mm. can you imagine being a parent just going? Uh, I am so uh, angry at you right now. <laughs> have the same effect it's not so <laughs> we've decided yeah we're going to be wrinkled up yeah because what's the point i'm saving my money to go on holidays instead oh okay you've just <laughs> opened a can of worms let's talk about holidays we know we have our trip coming up yes we say coming up but honestly, oh no it's still a little while away isn't it it's like over 120 days away oh. <laughs> who's counting no <laughs> But what have we, we've got a pack that we've said we are yeah. counting our steps each day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We so we're are. continuing to send each other little screenshots. Actually, did you send me I yours? I didn't send you no. one last <laughs> night, but I will. That's okay. That's okay. Um, that's my homework. Um, yep. We're trying, we're saying 10,000 a day. And, oh, that's hard. I haven't got to the biggest, I had such a big day last week. Yeah. And, on Friday, I walked so far and I purposely parked far away mm-hmm. and I walked in the city. My, I had blisters oh. and um, that day I got to 8,200. Yeah, that is ridiculous. That's the most I've got and I've ended up with sore feet and I'm thinking, hang on a minute, oh. are they counting two steps as in four steps? No, like- no. Maybe I've got my measurements <laughs> wrong. So are you taking smaller steps when you're walking now to get more steps? No, no. Surely it's just hooked up to the GPS mm. somewhere and working it all out. But no, <laughs> I went when I, I went to IT yesterday with um some girls and one of those girls said to me, Look, she takes Sunday off training. Mm. Like she won't do any exercise. But she goes, But I've already done my ten thousand steps and I was like, What? <laughs> and did she give like, you any tips how? Like what, what is she doing to get ten thousand? I just think, look, you're either one of these wonderful people who can exercise just naturally Mm -hmm. or you're someone who struggles a little bit like me. And we sit, oh, me too, but we sit a lot during the day Mm. in front of a computer. Mm -hmm. So I think, like we said, we need to raise the desk, Yes, get our treadmill out. I got my standing desk delivered the other day Mm -hmm. from Bunnings. Mm -hmm. I thought it was going to be a little higher than it is. Oh, it's it kind of look, like 
just above waist, mm. maybe just slightly above waist. So I'm not. So now you're right. a behemoth. Yeah, I'm just, <laughs> now I'm sort of like in between. Oh. I feel like a keyboard player. Oh, no. <laughs> anyway, but that's any, it, the thought was there. Okay. Um. Yeah, so we're trying to get into the, we're trying to get some barley bodies ready. Mm. And look, if I can't get the barley body. <laughs> What are we resorting I'm to? I'm going to buy the T-shirt with the bikini body on it. <laughs> <laughs> is that okay? Absolutely. <laughs> is that all right? Do you think they sell those on Shane? <laughs> uh, I'm sure they do. But can we talk about, I know we've got a few mm. hundred, no, a hundred or so sleeps to go. Yeah, yeah. What are we doing preparing for this trip? Like, I'm, I'm shopping already. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? I've done my orders. Why? I've done my orders Orders. Already. Your problem is, we know, you like to do one great big order. It's only because I get distracted on, I've got, I've only gone on there to get a couple of things. Anthony, turn the volume down now. But I only got, went on there. <laughs> I'm just checking that uh, Is he there? <laughs> I only went to get a couple of things and then Sheen to the rescue decide yeah. to add this, you know, and I look at that and then it continues to go and I've ended up buying a new something for the kitchen instead of for my yeah, holiday. Yeah, I know. They know how to get you. They and do. I think they rely on people with a short attention span. But I love the way you said go buy what you need. It's, it's free mean, shipping it's free and shipping. you get extra gifts that come in the post. What am I doing? Hang on a minute. Did I get any free gifts? No, as in oh. free shipping. Oh, but then you yeah. get multiple packages. That's, that's right. Yeah, you expect. Yeah, it's so exciting. Mm. I'd rather get multiple packages mm. than one big one for three hundred dollars, and it's like, oh, that's over. And then you when's know? the next shop? <laughs> I know because when's the next shop? <clears throat> exactly. So I know. Like mm. I can honestly do a uh, order. You know, two orders a day. Oh, that's so bad. Hey, but they, they're bargains. Mm. That's the thing. We've got to look at what we're saving. Mm. versus what we're send, spending. Yeah, I know. I know. I look at the value down the bottom and it says you saved $48, but oh. you've spent 210 Yeah, yeah, I know. But it's that well, that's, saving. That's girl math. Yeah, is it? That is girl <laughs> math and the guys don't understand that. <laughs> no, well, I went to Maya yesterday with my son because he needs a new wardrobe and it's at that odd age. He's turning 12. Where do you buy? Mm -hmm. And he's into streetwear. Mm. I didn't know it was such a thing for that age. Oh. Mm. No? 11 streetwear hmm. it's you think too young too young okay but he is one of three I, boys you know, so they're getting into that teen stage yeah. yeah uh maya had buy one and pay full price oh. or buy two and get 30 percent off yeah well i was buying more just because <laughs> to get the saving he probably didn't need all those t-shirts no. but because you could buy more saved more so that's my mentality. See, no, yeah, I sometimes I get that thing in my head where I think, no, they're just trying to trick me mm. and I'm not doing it. <laughs> Crazy, <laughs> I know. Crazy. Okay, you so think? what else are we buying to before we fly I've already out? bought all my dresses. Mm -hmm. I've yeah, look, I'm in that weird position because a lot of my stuff is packed away. So Yes. Anyway. So I just got a couple of like swimsuits. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Some dresses and mm. And we're going to celebrate my birthday over we there. Are. So I'm going to have to bring something nice. Yeah. Not Shane. Just no. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, and then I think we should really save our money just for all the massages. Oh, look. I mean, look, I'm tempted to get a little tattoo over there. Do we, do, have we spoken about this yet? We did early on. Um, okay. And we know we're getting one together. Yeah, it doesn't have to be matching. It doesn't. You know, just a little memento, a little keepsake. Oh, look, we yeah. we said we wanted to do so it in tiny. LA. Yeah, just something. I'm yeah. not, I'm not adventurous. So I wouldn't get something. I'm not going. I'm gonna, You're not going to go sleeve. and get a big whole sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wouldn't. Uh, but as long as it's fine line for me. Yeah, fine line. I'm thinking actually, I might want to get like a toe ring. Okay. Do you want to react to that? Yes. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Really. Uh, yeah. But you wear closed in shoes. Oh, not all the time. Oh. It's only because it's getting a bit cooler now. Okay. Oh, wait okay. till summer comes. Oh. So would you do it in black or would you have colour? I was actually thinking this the other day, like, you know, pink's my favourite colour. Why wouldn't I think about getting a pink, just a little pink heart or something or a pink tattoo? Mm. Why wouldn't I? Why I don't do we know. have to always do black? Black. I don't know. I mean, as much as I hate 
coloured tattoos like old style coloured mm, tattoos. No, not today. But why don't people get pink <clears throat> tattoos? Is that a thing? Uh, okay, we're going to research we'll re- that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're going to research that. So anyway, in the lead up to Bali, we are going to be walking every day, Mm -hmm. not together. (laughs) And you've got good opportunities. You've switched your thinking now. Oh, look, the gym was totally on my mind Mm. and then I knew I could. I talked myself out Mm. of it within a minute. (laughs) (laughs) I'm really excited. I'm going to go to the gym. I really need to insert that audio in here. (laughs) And then it was totally, no, let's be real. It was too long an audio though where you went from. We're going to join a gym. Yep. I'm so excited. Let's yep. do this burn. Yep. We're going to get this. This is amazing to full circle to like, no, who am I kidding? Am I I'm kidding? never going to the gym no, and I'm no, not wasting not my money. Not doing it. <laughs> <laughs> and it is a waste if you're not year. using it. Mm. So now my kids do sport five days, oh, seven days of the week, but three of those days I drive them and drop them and wait for them. Yeah. So I'm now walking while I'm waiting. And that's so good because normally you'd what, sit in the car. Mm-hmm. So that is a great opportunity. Mm-hmm. You've got to switch that around. And I started that on my birthday. So that is so good. that's nearly two weeks that I've been walking that three days amazing. of the week. So I've got to do it. And, it, and and I think I said it on the audio, as you do walk a little bit more and become a little mm. bit more fitter, it is actually you quite refreshing. Actually, yeah, you, you can feel see, so good. Yeah. At yeah. the time, where I walk, it's flat, and I mean flat, but I was doing an audio and I'm sure you could hear me having a heart attack. <laughs> a <little> puffed <laughs> out. <laughs> but I think I'm getting better and I'm getting quicker. So yeah. I know how long it was going to take me before to do five laps of the oval yeah. and I'm doing it a little bit quicker. That's so good. So Yeah, so that's good. We'll keep that up. <clears throat> and we've been doing our um, – research in Bali as well like mm-hmm. as to where we're going to go for dinners yes. and stuff like that we know yes. we're going to be podcasting every day every day every day even if it's just like 15 minutes it hey we matter. discovered this yep. spot hey yep. there's a new restaurant and what restaurant did we find that beautiful underwater yes. the only underwater restaurant in Bali uh, but then I again I know <laughs> like, but it was a good point I'm like how safe are we under the water I know and that's what's and it put is me new, off. Isn't it, it is new, but I've got friends that have just been, and the photos were unbelievable. Stunning. I've seen all the TikToks. It yep. looks amazing. Are we going to do it? Because it's what when you work it out into Australian dollars, it turns out to, you can do menus between one hundred and fifty and two hundred and fifty. Yep, which is really quite expensive it is. for Bali. It is, but really, Bali's not what it used to be. No. So I can't wait to get there. We're going to, you know, share all the info. Mm. Um, yeah, do you, because... you don't eat at the hotel though, do you? No, we discussed this. Yeah. yeah. Look, yeah. if breakfast was included, I would. Yeah, but no, but no we're, in we're general. venturing out. Yeah. Because I'm not one to eat at the hotel. I'll have breakfast, but I'm not a lover. Mm. But we will not. I don't really want to eat before midday anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. sessions that we can do. I want to find out the new, like I want to tell everyone like what are the best places to go for massages, mm-hmm. like from cheap to, you know, because then I saw there was a TikTok, I'm not going to remember the name of the place though now, but everyone goes to this one place. It's all pink brick. Carla. No. It's, oh. No, it's um, Body Works. Body Works, something like that. Okay. Something works, yeah. Yeah. It's all pink arches yeah. and everything. Everyone goes there for their massages. So yeah, I've been. Yeah. I just want to know, like, or do oh. we just go to our little local lady who's amazing and. There's a place called Febreze. I hope I'm saying that right. Oh, wow. It's a hotel and they do packages like for three hours for $50. No. Yeah. And I've oh meaning to try and I haven't and I think we're going to. Oh, my goodness. But is Walter, is he going to He's enjoy? not a massage person oh. at all. Oh. No. Anthony He'll be is. like, can I sleep and stay at the hotel and I'll meet you back when you get back. <laughs> what about if we got, um, while he's sleeping, we got them to come to the hotel? Oh, I would love that. Oh. It's not much I would more. Love that. It's so good. I uh, would... how how big are the rooms? So let's see. Is going to be is he going to be sleeping like with one eye open? Is he a light sleeper? Like would he enjoy having his feet rubbed while he's sleeping? I think he would just feel awkward. awkward. Mm. Yeah. No. no, it's not for him. I ain't doing pedicures. I can just tell you right now. No. I'm not having manicure or pedicures. I usually get mine done before. before. Yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. Last. So yeah. why? Because of 
fungal. Hygiene. Yeah. yeah. No yeah. way we're not having that. Yeah. But I think it's the way we've always done it is we're out for the morning, let's sit down and have a drink, grab a drink and have a massage while you're waiting in the cool air con. Do they do it poolside? Um, I'm sure like, they would. Because yes. when I was in Singapore and we used to stay on Sentosa mm. Island, mm. There was a man that actually was employed by that hotel and he'd just walk around and go like, did you want a massage? Did you want a and I, but what Every are you single day. Well, back then it was fine. This We're talking like 15, oh, 20 okay. years ago. So okay. it was fine. It was yeah. like $50. This is Singapore though. Yeah. Um, you know, and I'd get one every single day. But um, gosh, if they had one in a Bali hotel, oh, oh I'm sure, I'm sure we could. I or know we could just arrange, for arrange them. for them. Yeah, that and would if be we're amazing. the three of us are at least having a one hour each. Oh, oh, that oh. would be. I said, bring your friends. We all want to be oh, done at the same time. Yes, because I'd hate to be watching like, and going, <laughs> yeah. oh, hurry up. <laughs> yes, no, no. I think Bali's all about good food. Yes, massages and that cheeky bit of uh, oh. fake shopping. Yes. Oh, my mm. goodness. Mm. Well, that'll be interesting to see the quality of, you know, what yep. they have as yep. well. Yeah. And even if, like, there's a place that even just makes leather. Yeah, I've never goods. done it. I've never done that. But yeah. I think you need to be there at least four or five days yeah. to get something made. We'd have know. to go in the first day, yeah. if, you know. Yeah. You know, that's if something grabs us like yeah, that. So I've anyway. heard shoes, leather shoes or boots. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, because it's getting harder and harder to buy, buy. leather shoes. Isn't well, it? then you'd get something made just for your side. And I always have one. I think my left is that your left or your right's bigger. Whatever. Like if you're right-handed, your right foot is bigger okay. slightly. Yep. That's why whenever I try shoes on, I'll just try the right. I don't, I don't even bother with the left. I didn't even think of One, because I'm lazy, and two, because <laughs> if it fits the rise, it's always going to fit the left. It's always. Yeah, okay. okay. 100%. Okay. So, yeah. But in order, like, for us to be getting ready mm. to barley mm. and eating-wise, mm. you know, I'm trying to cut sugar out at night time, okay, because I was the late night, let's just have some sugar, let's have some chocolate, let's have some tea and biscuits, like mm, random, I know. stupid. And I know when I start doing silly stuff like that, it really starts to show. Yeah. Are you doing anything diet-wise before we? Um, I've tried to minimise my portion sizes, mm -hmm. but then that's really hard because I'm hungry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. And I don't eat regularly. Mm -hmm. I know it's, and that's water. I, I know. I know All what right. I should be doing. But have you heard the blue plate theory? I have not. Mm. Please tell me more. So apparently if you buy a blue plate, wow. smaller size, uh -huh. your mind doesn't, like your mind, how am I explain it? Mm. You get fuller quicker mm. so you don't eat as much because of the blue coloured plate. So there's some kind of psychology behind mm. Mm -hmm. this blue colour mm. plate. And, you know, since you sort of mentioned this to me, where was I? I was in Spotlight the other day and they had 30% off. Anyway, and I was looking at their dinnerware and stuff, not one blue no, plate. No, you don't find blue. You're really? Not going so to. it must be true. Okay. Because they're they're going against us. <laughs> <laughs> they don't want us to be skinny. And I've been looking for the blue plate. It's not going to happen. And before you know it, we're, we're going to be on that plane. I know. So I know. have you changed your flight to be with me? Yet? I know I'm, I'm no, I haven't yet. Okay, no, it's, that's fine. I will and be. You don't have I to no, but I because... we always do a morning flight, so I don't know. Yeah. It was obviously a financial decision. Oh, and you know, because <clears throat> me and Walter can't wait so much for this trip. <laughs> Go on. We are already trying to plan another trip. I always try and have a trip planned Before. when I've left where yes. I've just been. I think that's a great – I think we will eventually fall into mm -hmm. this nice little routine. Mm -hmm. Even um, if it's a little even staycation. Yeah. You just need something to look forward to. Take the edge off. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, so you're on to cruises at the moment. Oh, so on to cruises and now we're just contemplating. We're having mm -hmm. a look mm -hmm. maybe before the end of the year or maybe December, possibly a New Zealand cruise. So why do you think cruises are so more affordable now? Are people still scared to go on one, do you think? Um, I don't know. I know a few people that love their cruises. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm definitely going to be turning into the cruise queen. Mm. I have been on many. Mm. But 
I just honestly, it's such an affordable holiday when you think that the food, the accommodation, the entertainment, yes. you're not paying to go and see a show. No. You've got a Broadway quality show yep. every night. Yep. Um, you've got karaoke, you've got Endless. buffets, Endless. you've yes. got, um, you know, walking tracks on the ship, you've got gyms, you've got, you've got classes, Pilates, if you want, yep. um, you've got day spa. I mean, oh, it's, just, it's so why much. wouldn't you want to go? So. so do you look at the reviews for the ages? Like you're not hitting a cruise that's got retirees on there, are I've you? I've never even once looked at no, I've never because you once make it your own. It. No, because it's just the it's such a big ship. Mm. How could you possibly have all eighty year olds on a <laughs> ship that's got four thousand people? It's impossible. Yes, yes, I've been. I've just yeah. There's so many different age groups. There's kids. There's you know mature. There's twenty year olds. There's mm-hmm. all different mm-hmm. everything. Mm-hmm. So yeah, you can't really pigeonhole it like. You know, a lot of, I think the last one we went on, there was 2,800 people on that cruise ship. So we're looking forward to now trying a much bigger boat. Mm -hmm. So very excited. And do you pre-book your room? You don't just like, yeah. Yes. So we definitely, yeah, definitely Mm pre-book. Yeah. And and otherwise, if you don't, you will just get whatever, like room on that deck or whatever style room that you book. Yeah. So there is an option to book your specific room Mm -hmm. or that style of state room or whatever with the balcony. Oh, it has to be with the balcony. You need that air, don't you? Yes. Yeah. 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 I saw a TikTok of a girl that was saying, you know, she was travelling on a cruise with her sister. She wanted to save money and apparently the difference was like $300, $400 or something for the room if there was no balcony. Right. She was like, do we really need a balcony? Mm. But for me it's more like I want fresh air. Fresh air. I want. Yeah. What if something did happen? I mean we have been through a pandemic. What if something did happen? Yeah. And you just want to stay away. Mm -hmm. And just Mm -hmm. get that fresh air Mm -hmm. and or jump off. (laughs) We'll go with option A. But, yeah, I think it gives yeah. you an option. It's, there's so many things out there. Mm. We used to look forward when we had the cruises where they used to give you the itinerary that underneath the door. Mm-hmm. It would slid, slide underneath the door and we would go, oh, yeah, we need to be here for this time, here for that time. Yeah. And it was just the night before you would plan what you wanted to do. Yeah. We took walkie-talkies on our last one. Yeah. So the kids all could, because you can leave them on their own. Yeah. You know. Oh, so, yeah. It's so. They're not going anywhere. No. Yeah. No. Do you so, do day trips? Oh, the last cruise we did was through Thailand, Vietnam. Mm-hmm. And, um, yeah, we, me and Walter had been to a lot of these places already. So Walter was like, I am not getting off to see a port yes. sort of place. Yes. And then in order to get to the mainland, you know, it's like we're looking at four hours sometimes. Yeah. And yeah. we were like, no, we're here to have a good relaxing holiday. Yeah. But yeah. obviously the next cruise we do will be bucket list places yeah. we haven't been to before and yeah. we will definitely get off. Yeah. What about you? Um, if I haven't been there, we will. But we we did the naughty and left the kids on the ship while we ventured out one night in Thailand. Gee, what happened if you had an accident? We didn't think of that. <laughs> you're you're so going to make a had, great mum one uh, day, Kimmy. <laughs> <laughs> we had the nights. It was a night out where the kids could have a sleepover at the kids' club. Yeah. I never throw my kids in kids club. Yeah. We don't go take them on a holiday to be thrown in a kids yeah. club. But this was perfect for them and they they needed just to have downtime and the mm. kids wanted a bit of device time. So we said, "You know what? You stay the night in the kids club and we're heading out." So we met up with a couple of other couples on the cruise and we all got it cheaper to get into the city as such mm. from the port. Went out. It wasn't like I, I wanted to watch a lady boy show. Yeah. Can't take the kids no. to that. <laughs> And I wanted to have a dinner out on the street. Yeah. So we did that. We made it back. Like you had to be back on that cruise by like mm. 2 a.m. before it took off. We were still in the cab at one. And I was like, Anthony, oh we've Tracy. left four children. We d- and you don't Tracy. have your passport because you leave it all on there. You know, when you think about it now, I'm not adventurous. That was what, the biggest adventure. Yeah, what were we thinking? What were we thinking? Do you know oh. how many I watch all these reality shows with boats and oh. – 
they are not allowed to stay one no. minute over time. No. no. And it's you it's too bad. Yep. If you are sixty so even if they see you running down the jetty, it's off. they're not waiting. No. Oh So I know what, what were we thinking? Um, it won't happen again. Oh my God. But <laughs> our kids are I older. would have been back <gasps> by ten PM. Oh look the oh show didn't start okay? till ten. That's the oh stupid my. thing. Yeah, I know I've been to one of those that was in Thailand. Yeah, yeah. Been to one of those many years ago and they're so good. Oh look. What's the famous place again called? Oh um oh, I'm, not, I'm not gonna gosh, remember that. This was like twenty years ago. Yeah. I'm sure it's still there. It is the most famous place to see Lady Boy shows and it was the, I'm going to say women yes. that were performing. Un- the bone structure and the beauty and the they were women. I'm, I yep. swear. It's until they speak yeah. that they, they look stunning. unbelievable. Oh, so I can imagine. I know it would have been hard to get away. And then they come out after <laughs> yeah. you get photos yep. with them. They're like yep. movie stars I know. over there. Their gowns. So, yeah, no, we won't be doing that again. <laughs> I know, you've got to be. But I think a cruise is the way to go. It's affordable yeah. and you obviously do the drinks package. Yes, oh. I do. we do premium. Mm-hmm. So I know the next cruise we're going on, we're doing premium drinks package and so that is any like top shelf, yeah. up to $15. You're on holiday. Per, no, up to $30 30. per drink Yep, and up to 15 drinks a day. You're never going to hit <laughs> that amount. We're never going to hit it. Well, Unless we start with Bloody Mary's Shots. for breakfast. <laughs> but no, that's just yeah. not who I am. But no. it's just nice to have the premium. Yep. Yeah, drinks. And then you don't have to worry about it. It's and paid. How do you feel about the um, hygiene in the buffet areas on a cruise? I've only cruised pre COVID. Yeah. Um, we were a bit unsure that you could go in the fine dining still included right but with kids you wanted the options you know i loved sizzler with kids mm. so you would think on a cruise buffet is the way to go no i'm not doing it you overeat uh, we did quite mm. a few times but then you know you see some i don't know some people you know what you know what would annoy me at the buffet mm-hmm. is like when people would bring their own water bottles oh and then they're touching the mouthpiece on the water Yuck. that you're going to be putting into your glass. Yes. And I'm like, oh, Yuck. God. Yuck. That would annoy me. Yeah. Because we are pretty, like, clean yep. freaks. Yes. Sort of, like, so, yeah, that's the only thing that annoyed me. But, I mean, where we went was actually very, every station was separate. Mm-hmm. It wasn't like a long line of sizzler kind of thing. Yeah. Every station yep. was, like, Italian. Yep. That's separate clean. Yep. Then, you know, sushi separate claim. Do people so, use their fingers? No, I, no, I think. How do they monitor that? Good, yeah. But there are people with staff walking good. all the time, mm. ta- you know, talking. Hello, this, hello, that. And the service was probably really good in most, too good. You yeah. know, sometimes you can have it yeah. too good and you're yeah. like, can you just leave me? Yes, like, yes. Second, it's just like, I just want to <laughs> eat without interruptions. <laughs> I know. <laughs> down to like etiquette like so we would eat in this fine dining yep. restaurant and they would just come and check on us every minute and yeah. it was like oh, yeah I'm sorry we're actually in the middle of a full-blown argument right now <laughs> can you actually leave me alone <laughs> i'm actually just about to unleash onto oh, Walter. <laughs> okay now can we talk about outfits just quickly mm. Now we're going together. Are you going to be one of those people that look at me and say, you wore that yesterday? No. No? I don't so care. could I wear the same thing twice on holidays? You could. But you're, you're not? I'm bringing a dress per day. And then I think to myself, why? Why mm. are you bringing a dress? Why don't you bring jeans and matching tops? But it's going to be so hot in Bali. I don't want to bring I always jeans, bring but... a skirt, denim skirt or shorts. Yep. And Good. then multiple tops to wear with that. That's why I'm just getting on to shame. <laughs> <laughs> Start ordering. Good and idea. Then the yeah. dresses you can only wear really single That's uses. That's right. So why did I order eight dresses then? I ordered five this morning. This morning. And I'm still going so to bring exciting. my skirt and eight tops for a five-day yeah. holiday. And then make sure my rule that mm. you have to follow is either beige or black um, shoes, whatever. So you can just mix and match all the time. Nude shoes. Do you it. wear like nice shoes when you're there? I knew you were going to say this. Oh. Like, look, Bali is different because it's hard to wear 
like you can't really wear heels. No. I would say wedges, but then really, well, that would be my dressy shoe. Oh, I only bring thongs. Okay. Heavies. I have to rephrase. You know, what, I thongs? love the way you judge people. <laughs> For wearing sneakers when you are a bloody thong wearing girl. Yes. <laughs> you yes. Think, you think you wouldn't be judgy? Because <laughs> sneakers trump thongs. Very. But especially with the sneaker culture, how it mm. is at the moment, mm. so mm. fancy schmancy. Mm. But, you know, but yeah, no, I'm a thong girl. I love thongs. Uh, I'm a thong girl in Bali. Yes. But I can't wear sneakers. It's too hot. Yeah. Although, how comfy would it be to walk around the streets with them? No. So good. That's I why I have to. It. I'm going to do. Sort Are of you maybe going some to bring low wedges just for a bit of? Oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just to feel like I'm a little bit dressy. Uh, are we doing day trips? Are we going to venture out? I don't enjoy venturing out. I know a lot of people go, oh, yeah, I'm going to go to Nosa Dua. No, <laughs> I'm not. Nosa Dua tomorrow. No. And I'm like, oh, 45 minutes. No, I I'm on a holiday. I don't even want to say to you we'll meet at 11 a.m. because that's putting pressure on me yeah. that I need to be ready by 11 a.m. Exactly. And I'm on holiday. So I think the best thing, because there's Wi-Fi everywhere, Yeah. see you, see you tomorrow Yeah. and then <laughs> you have your sleep in. I'm an early riser. I'll 100%. go out and get my whatever done. Yep. And then it will be a quick little, hey, Burn, what are you up to? Yeah. And it's yeah. not, are we meeting up? It's yeah. not, I'm checking up on you. It's more, it's I'm just, having a massage. Yeah. Invitations open type 100%. Of thing. 100%. Mm. Yeah. Mm. That's so good. And I think we're going to make really good travel partners because, oh. God, this is going to be chill. Yes. <laughs> yes. Well, I think that's uh, we've done well about it for today. Let's hope we've made some listeners How go and venture we... out to book a holiday, or to buy some clothes, or <laughs> to go on Sheen and buy more useless Such purchases. Such bad influences <laughs> we are. We're, uh, we're not even sponsored. By, Absolutely no, not. We're no, not. No. Um, okay. So we meanwhile got to set the timer on our phones for oh, Bali. Yes, and make the time go quicker. Okay. <laughs> Done. Until then, we'll see you next see you time. Guys. Bye. Bye, bye. Bye. Thank you all for listening to the Ladies Lounge podcast. We hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you liked what you heard, please take a moment to leave us a five star rating and review. Your feedback helps us grow and improve the show. Don't forget to share this episode with your friends, family, and anyone else you think might enjoy it. Until, Until next time, time, this is Bernadette and this is Tracy signing, signing off. off. Have, Have a, a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. day.